the two characters you play. So give me a sense of the, like, literally the logistics of it, because you, there are these conversations in, in essentially your mind, in a way, yeah. uh, between these two characters. Have you, like, recorded VO as one character, and then are you listening to yourself? Yes, exactly. Um, during the rehearsal process, when we were back in Louisiana, um, Andrew and I just went into the studio for a day and um, recorded all of Melanie's VO dialogue. We have flashbacks and, and things like that with Melanie as well, um, which was great because I just got to play Melanie and get used to being her and everything. Um, and we did that near the start of the shoot, so at least I had that in my head. Um, but yeah, we had the VO and we've roughly recorded it. We're, we're going to have to re-record it again for the, you know, the actual the final, final cut. Yeah, yeah. Um, and what they've done is just they have the recordings and I wear an earwig whenever there's a scene between Wanda and Melanie and I talk to myself. I listen to my own voice for hours and hours on end and I talk to myself and it's surprisingly easy to do. It's um, it's amazing. It's it's just like a voice in your head, you know. How are you to work with as a collaborator? I'm a horrible person to work, to work with. Yeah. I hate working with me. I'm a diva. <laughs> I'm very demanding. And I'm a squinter, which we've discussed yeah, already. Yeah. Since we're out in the desert now, you can see that because of my blue eyes, I squint constantly. So the contacts that you've had to employ for this. Yeah. Uh, annoyance? Uh, helping you? Give me a sense of what that's been like. Uh, both. They were a bit annoying at the start, just because my eyes are very sensitive. and um, I had tried lenses on years ago for another film, and it was a nightmare. It was horrible. And I just so when they you told know. you you had to do this, you're like, oh, here so we go I'm not again. doing the movie. <laughs> I'm not doing it. Um, but I, I did do it in the end. That's why I'm it's here. It's that good. Yeah, it's that good. Um, but no, I got used to it. I yeah. mean, I I had tried to put the contact lenses in myself, and that didn't work. It took me like half an hour just to get one contact lens into my eye. So it was awful. But um, but we have lens techs on the film, and, and there's one who works with me every day, and, and he's brilliant. He's the only one who I'll let go near my eyes. <laughs> he's got the privileges of so. the, the eye privileges. You don't want to let anybody just touch your eyes. That's scary. No, it's very sensitive. Yeah. Your eyes are very sensitive. And if you don't trust yourself to touch your eyes, why would you trust anyone else? So, um, yeah, but it's down from like half an hour now to 30 seconds. So. And you're comfortable with the, with the color hair? Are you liking... I love... Yeah, I've forgotten now that my hair was blonde before. <laughs> um, well, I did a film before this and my hair was brown as mm -hmm. well.